it's Dawson and a lady. Welcome to my humble abode. Oh, oh, oh. No. <laughs> Clearly, I've been cooped up inside for far too long. This actor looks very familiar. Okay. This will work. I know it will because I have set it up. And yep, yeah, it's not working. Cool. This is really not good colour coordination. There we go. We can see something. We can see a teddy bear. Very cute. Oh my gosh, you know what I sound like? I sound like that video. I'm gonna insert it right now. I'm sleepy. I'm tired. I have the poop. Kitty. I've been doing great. How are you? Surely there's a way to make this a little bit brighter. I don't know. I'm not good at this. I can never tell whether I'm in focus. I know right now I'm not in focus. Yeah? Yeah? No. Is that better? So, right now I'm sick at home, but it's good. I felt like filming because my whole family's out. So, right now I'm watching Dawson's Creek. Haha. -ha. Look at them. It's Dawson and a lady who is not a main character. So that's fun. So for the past, this is going weird. Why am I doing a British accent? If you can't already hear, I am sick. It's fine. The world goes around. But for the past like three or four days, I've been walking around the home looking like Kathleen Kelly and you've got mail. I have a terrible cold. <laughs> When she's sick with all those tissues, except I don't have a nice Tom Hanks bringing me daisies and coming to my house. Instead, I have the postman coming to my house and bringing me books. So, you know, you win some, you lose some. Today is a good day. Yesterday, I was a lot more congested than this. I could not taste anything. Don't worry, I got a COVID test. It's negative. Today, I can actually breathe through my nose, which is fun. <laughs> we like breathing. And, you know, I've been looking like this in my dressing gown. Yeah. I put on makeup so you don't have to see me looking all dead, even though I still look kind of rough, which is what the life is. I don't even know what I'm talking about in this video. This is literally just a ramble because I'm sick and I'm lonely. And I've watched like the whole of the last season of Dawson's Creek the past few days because I've just been in front of the TV watching TV. Wow, I'm congested. What am I? I literally don't know. I don't know anymore. I was gonna say something and it's completely escaped me. Um, um, uh, here's the thing with Dawson's Creek. I've already watched this see <laughs> my nose is a cheap. So I've already watched the series all the way through and right now I went through it again and I'm in the last season again and now I'm just like I really miss the first season. The first season was so like nostalgic and it was so, well, it was so like special and magical and the music was just like, and everything was so good and the characters, you know, they were like, I don't know where I'm going with this. Okay, if anyone is watching this and they know Dawson's Creek, I, I love Dawson and Joey's theme the like music score for them is like perfect and they use it in just the right moments because it just brings back this like special feeling from season one season one and season two were the best ones i think in my eyes because they were just like wholesome and then pacey and andy together were like really good i don't know why why did they have to write her to be like okay you know this is going too far. Clearly, I've been cooped up inside for far too long and I've just become invested in this world that isn't reality. And I need honey and lemon. Come on, let's go make one. <laughs> do, 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 do. My neighbors are going to see me. Do, 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 do. That's the second theme. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Look at the teddy bear. Look at this t-shirt. Look at this t-shirt. That's not the second theme. That's the first theme. 
What is the second theme? Oh my gosh. I need I need in my phone. This is the second theme. Oh yeah. really ruined the moment okay you know you know you get you get the idea the other day on my YouTube it just came up someone had like a Dawson's Creek wedding like at Dawson's house like in the front garden and everything and I was like hold on I think my mission in life is to go to America oh my gosh and go to Cape Side and visit the house and visit all the locate like the iconic location like that would be good what was i doing i was making honey lemon That's okay. da -da -da -da. Dancing at my wedding to this song. Yeah, that's me. How do you know the ratio of honey to lemon? Because sometimes I get it wrong and sometimes I get it very right. I'm sweating. <laughs> Yesterday I missed church because I was sick, obviously. And that made me sad because, oops. Because at 5 p.m. I usually have church. And I usually get to see my friends. Gonna get the honey. It makes me sad, you know? And also tomorrow I'm meant to have a Bible study, which is very nice. We are going through Ephesians at the moment. Let's see how this tastes. It's very hot. Hey, that's good! I'm actually really happy. Usually I never get that right on the first go. But I did. Okay, you're gonna come back with me. Okay, welcome to my humble abode. Another thing that's happened. So a show that I liked that I feel like gave me, gave me similar 90s vibes is called My So-Called Life. I watched a few episodes of that when I was younger and I really liked it. It has Claire Danes and Jared Leto. Jared Leto. 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 Leto Cinemas. I was never able to find it anywhere, wasn't on any streaming platforms, and 
it's really hard to get like the DVDs for it. Turns out it's on Disney Plus now. So I think that's what I'm going to watch next. That's <laughs> very exciting, I know. You just totally asked for the, all of that information. Oh, another thing I've been watching recently is called Mind Hunter. Why is that word hard to say when you're sick? I would highly recommend to watch it, by the way. It's very good. Although last night I did have a dream about like Ed Kemper, one of the serial killers or one of the killers, the murderers in the show. And that wasn't fun. I woke up and I was like, hold on. <laughs> it was really funny because I started watching it with my family and then I, I, I thought to myself, hold on a second. This actor looks very familiar. And then I realised. He's the king from Hamilton. Huh? And I was like, mom, this is the king from Hamilton. The one that spits a lot. And... It's really funny. And he's in this show about the psychology of serial killers. And it was a wild moment. Oh, you know what I really like? The movie called Sing Street. Oh my goodness, I love the soundtrack to it. It's like 80s. It's in the 80s in Dublin, in Ireland. Yeah, so it's about this kid and he likes this girl. And he's like, oh hey, do you wanna be in this music video for this song that my band's written. And she's like, okay. And then, so he's like, well, great, now I have to form a band because I don't have one. And so he forms a band, but then music becomes something more to him. And it's like a musical, but it's done really well because it does not feel like a musical musical, like, ah. Like, it feels like it just flows really well. And I would really recommend it. It's a funny story, the card got full. Um, but I think it's time that we talk about the song called One, the version by U2 and Mary J. Blythe, because that is superior. I think it's time. We play a little song, do a little dance, get out of my sickness, and just have a good time. Okay, are you ready? <laughs> okay. The lighting is terrible. Okay, everyone. Are you ready? No, this will probably get copyrighted. But I'll just play a little bit. Because this song slaps, okay? It's amazing. This version of the, with the both of them. Boy. It's good. It's good! Hold on! This is not the right version! Silly me. This is the right version. Is it getting better? Do you feel the same? This angle there is crooked. Thank <laughs> you.